what would have been like one of the biggest challenges that you didn't expect in being a founder? I guess it, I'd heard about it, but obviously it's one thing to hear about it. It's an, another thing to experience it. I think it's just the, sometimes it can feel very untethered because you're literally creating something out of nothing. It's by your own will and your own forcing, uh, your own sort of um, you know, drive and motivation that it happens. So even minute things, like every single decision was up for debate, every th- single product feature, every single pricing, um, like, you know, the way, not just pricing, like how do you price your product, but what is the product and how do you describe it? And do you price it in a recurring way? Do you price it in a, like, you know, how open and transparent are you with pricing? Do you benchmark it to one thing or another? Like there's a million different small decisions that come with the details and the tactical decisions you have to make. And I think I knew that that would happen, but I kind of, I don't think I fully appreciated before I did it, how much um, uncertainty there would be and how much learning and constant readjustment would happen. But sometimes part of the learning as well is like, when do you stop adjusting? When do you stop just taking in information and you just say, okay, this might be wrong, but I'm just going to do it. And then I'm going to quickly take in that data and then I will readjust. And when do you say, I'm not gonna readjust anymore because you could try to please everyone and try to make all these tweaks and refinements, but you just have to make a decision and commit to it. So all these things are just, very amorphous until you start to create some solid structure around it yourself. 